Photoshop CS3 introduces a pair of powerful new commands for automatically aligning and blending the contents of layers. So now let's take a look at a couple cases where that would be useful. In this first case, I've got a pair of photographs of a group of people. And they were taken handheld without a tripod. So you notice as I switch between the two layers, they're not really in alignment with each other. And the problem I'd like to solve is that in some of the photos, some people look good, but other people don't. So in this case, this guy's smiling, but this guy and this girl aren't looking at the camera. If I switch to the other, now these two are looking at the camera, but this guy isn't smiling. So what I'd like to do is blend the two layers together so that I can get the best people in each shot. Now rather than having to do that by hand, I can simply select both layers, go up to the Edit menu, and choose Auto Align Layers. When I do that, Photoshop gives me some options for how to do the alignment. I'm simply going to choose Auto and hit OK. And when I do that, Photoshop analyzes the pixel data. And so as a result, when I switch between these two layers, you can now see they're perfectly aligned. And that makes it easy for me to go in and add a layer mask, grab my brush tool, and simply paint from one layer to the other. So to make this girl look at the camera, I can simply paint and show the image underneath this layer. So, like so. And to make this guy look at the camera, I simply paint on him. And now it reveals the contents of the underlying layer. So, in just a couple of steps, I was able to take the best elements from each photo and merge those into one result. Now, in the second case, I'm going to take a new script under the File menu called Load Files to Stack and use that to load up the pieces of a panorama. So I have four pictures here that were taken of the same door, each different segments. When I choose OK, you'll notice Photoshop has loaded up each one as a layer inside one PSD file. Now I can simply select those four layers, go back to the Edit menu, and choose Auto Align Layers. In this case, I want to choose Cylindrical Mapping and hit OK. When I do that, you'll notice Photoshop has done a pretty decent job of aligning these layers and even warping them so that they line up pretty reasonably. You'll notice, though, in a couple cases, you can see some seams. The color isn't quite right, and some of the details don't line up. So to deal with that, I go back to the Edit menu, and now I choose Auto Blend Layers. And now what you'll see as a result is that Photoshop has gone in and not only changed the details, but has gone in and adjusted the lighting and the shading so that everything matches up. If I hit Undo, you can see that's before. Hit Undo again, and that's after. You'll also notice that Auto Blend generates layer masks. So if I want to go in later and fine-tune those by hand, I can. So it's not a choice of letting the computer do it automatically or doing it yourself. You can always go back and fine-tune.